Hello, in this video I will show you how to convert a string to an integer type in C sharp. Very simple arrangement and this works in .NET Core, .NET Framework, .NET 5, everywhere in C sharp. It all works the same way. Now, uh, the conversion, if you want to save some time here, uh, happens by using convert and then to int 32, okay? As a parameter, you provide your string and it gets converted. This is how the conversion happens. And if you only needed that, you got that information. But if you want to learn a bit more, stick with me and I will show you now. In this case, we have uh, three strings, okay? Three strings and then three integers, okay? so. Uh, S1 gets converted and assigned to I1, S2 to I2, and S3 to I3, okay? That's how it works. Now, take a look at these, take a look at these, and think and guess which ones or which one will work and which ones or which one will not work. Now, if you took your guess, I will explain. So an integer, an integer or a string rather for an integer has to be a number. OK, it has to be a number. It also has to be a number with no decimal. OK, just a simple straightforward number. And that is what we have right here. String S1. Therefore, if we convert S1 and assign it to I1, it will work. Now, if you look at S2, you can see we have a dollar sign, right? We have a dollar sign. Therefore, it will fail. It can't understand that. It will fail. It will throw an exception. The same goes for S3. You could actually convert the string to double, okay? You can convert it to double, but you cannot convert it to integer. This is very important, right? You cannot do that. And both of these issues will throw an exception. So you must either have to be sure, okay? You have to be sure, or you have to use those exceptions for these things, uh, uh, try and catch statements rather, uh, to handle these exceptions. Another thing is uh, we have 2 int 32. So this int is int 32. Now you have int 64, that's big int sometimes called, and then you have small int, which is int 16, right? What we need here is int 32, and that is our simple int in C sharp. So that's all for this little topic. Do take a look at my other how-to videos at my other business and technology videos uh, and also take a look at some of my courses some of my books uh, uh, learn something about c sharp learn blazer learn api development and do subscribe to this channel as well